This is Tailgate Talk, presented by Tarpon Blue. In this series, we're going to show you everything Texas and its surrounding southern states has to offer from our very own tailgate. We'll take you from life on the farm and the ranch to the big city lights. This is Tailgate Talk. Come along for the ride. I'm Kara Colby. Thank you for tuning in to this week's Tailgate Talk. Today we are at the Seguin Public Library. Um, this is downtown Seguin off of West Nolte Street. And fun fact, there used to be a different library in Seguin over in the Bower Park area. But this one opened on September 8th of 2016. It is 43,000 square feet. And in that 43,000 square foot, they have tons of different opportunities. Uh, you can come here for computer time, which they have it for children and adults. Um, they have a teen room. They have several different outdoor decks that you can go to. Uh, conference rooms for groups up to 122 people. And they also have smaller conference rooms too, where you can book for a smaller group up to about 20 people. Um, several different uh, programs that they're offering to each day. We'll put up the calendar so that you're able to see what kind of different programs and activities they do. I know personally I like to bring my son here for their toddler time which is on Tuesdays at 10 a.m. They also have a baby reading time, they have teen time, they have reading with your stuffed animals, uh, so many different things that you can come for on a rainy day or just whenever it's too hot in our Texas summers. And just a fun fact, uh, about four years ago I, when I was getting my real estate license, I had a one-year-old at home and you know how that goes with trying to study. So this is actually where I would come to do my studying and take my tests and everything. Um, they have perfect little nook areas that are so quiet and peaceful and actually very comfortable <laughs> where you can just come and sit and get your work done and then go back home to the madness. <laughs> But we will put up the calendar um, regarding all of the cool activities. So another cool thing that I read about the library is that all of the trees that were cut down to build in this area were actually used in this library. They reclaimed the wood and used it for tables in the conference rooms. They used it for the really cool wall pieces for decoration. Um, there's benches that are made out of the wood from it, all pecan. So it's really neat and if you're into trees you should at least come and check that area out as well. In a previous episode of Tailgate Talk we explored the Walnut Trail, um, the walking trail through Seguin. And this actually, that runs right through here. So if you were ever going on the trail, I don't know if you can see it this way, but the trail runs through um, along the creek and then you could be all hot and sweaty and come in and cool off in the library and read some books or you know just hang out on one of the computers, have some quiet reading time, hang out on one of the patios to finish drinking your water. <laughs> but we are going to go and try and catch some of the toddler time um, maybe get a story in the children's area, and I think that y'all should come along and check it out too. So thanks for tuning in to this week's Tailgate Talk at the Seguin Public Library. Remember to come and check it out sometime during this hot Texas summer or just when you're bored or hitting the trail. Come back in to cool off for a little bit and check things out. 
several different opportunities, activities, especially if you have children. So thank you for tuning in and we will see you next week on Tailgate Talk. Thanks for tuning in today and thank you to our guests for sharing their story. Be sure to follow us on Facebook and Instagram and subscribe to our YouTube channel. We'll see you next time on Tailgate Talk. Oh,